CPS has half the number of bus drivers it had just a decade ago, and the district has only grown since then. And JCPS says pay isn't the problem. WDRB's Christy Batista found it pays better than several other districts in our area. School's out for summer, but a lot of families are already thinking about next year and the bus situation. Will it be better? Some bus drivers have different opinions on how to get more of them behind the wheel and keep them there. To me, it's kind of chaos. Chaos is a way many people have described last school year. Thank you for calling transportation. She didn't want us to show her name or face, but she has years of experience as a former school bus and truck driver. She says she couldn't believe what she saw last year. I, I just, I would be so ballistic if my child was on a bus that long. That's ridiculous. It didn't stop some current drivers like Felix Menner, though. Menner started driving for JCPS after the problems at the beginning of the year. I want to help because if there's a need, that means there's a deficit. And if I can help out in that way, I have no problem even being a body to fill a void or, you know, putting myself on the line to help. JCPS says it has 550 drivers. That's down from 1,100 nearly a decade ago. It's a problem that districts across the country are facing. There are simply not enough drivers behind the wheel. The pay for, in my experience, is actually fantastic. Is it worth it though, you know? Depends on who you ask. JCPS says its pay is competitive. Starting at $22.87 an hour, it is higher than other districts in our area. Bullitt County is $20.40 an hour. Bus drivers in Hardin County now start out at $20.14 an hour. Oldham County just increased its starting salary to $19.25. Nelson County Schools pay $17.96 an hour. Across the river, Greater Clark County Schools pays $21.25 to start. After an increase, New Albany Floyd County Schools now pays the most at $27.67 an hour. As for current drivers, Menor is hopeful next year will be a little smoother, but just as rewarding. It's been the best job I've ever had. With photojournalist Brian Manuel, Christy Batista, WDRB News.